This man could be a spy. Any one of these people could be a spy. This is the story of five real spies, a ring of spies. Headlines that made world news. Names that added a shattering new chapter to the records of espionage. How have we got on? I haven't. Nothing? Not a thing. There's no devil good you threatening me either. What kind of people are these who held the safety of a nation in their hands? Why did they do it? How were they caught? Now these questions are answered in a compelling film called Ring of Spies. And never, never has fact so outstripped fiction for daring and for suspense. Listen, buddy, I'm not asking you to do anything. I wouldn't get you mixed up in anything, whatever it was. Well, what are you asking, then? Simply to leave the safe door open for a few minutes on Friday afternoon, and then go and powder your nose. The truth behind the lace curtains of suburbia. The secrets of treason. The startling facts about the spies who lived in this very bungalow at number 45 Cranley Drive, Ricelip, Middlesex. Oh, hello, Gordon. Hi, Alan. Behind this door were all the tools. The gadgetry of the men and women who formed that sinister circle, a ring of spies. Hold everything very steady. I... To think of all the great books of the world, reduced to a dot, a full stop. How many more of these secret agents roam our cities undetected, unknown? How do you recognize a spy? These ordinary-looking people engaged in that most extraordinary, most hazardous of all professions, spying. Houghton, be a good fellow and give this to Miss G to put in the safe, will you? Very good, sir. The man next to you may be a spy. 